Embedding AI agents is a powerful way to distribute and deploy your AI agents on any custom URL. MindStudio allows you to embed AI agents seamlessly into any product or website using signed access URLs without requiring end users to sign up for a MindStudio account. Let me quickly show you how it works. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to our root config folder and then under sharing, we'll find the signed URLs tab. From here, we'll see a few things. The first is a list of all of your managed users. These are every unique individual that has access the embedded AI agent. Underneath that, we'll see a couple of different ways in which we can embed our AI agent. The first and recommended method is to create managed users and signed URLs using the MindStudio API. The way it works is your backend requests a signed access URL from the API and you can optionally include a user ID so that you can track the run history of that particular user. MindStudio then responds with a signed URL that then gets used in the iframe that you display on the front end of your website. The other method is guest access. And while this may be a little more convenient, it is a bit less secure because it allows anybody to directly access the AI agent. Guest users will also have limited access to run history and their past runs may be erased without notice depending on their browser settings. Let's go ahead and enable guest access for a more convenient iframe. From here, we'll get some code which we can copy and then we'll go into the website builder and we'll add a code embed. Then we'll simply paste the custom code in we can modify a couple of things. And when we're ready, we can save and close. And you'll notice that the AI agent is being displayed in our website builder. Now we can go ahead and publish the page. And when we open the page, you'll notice that the AI agent is now being run from within our website. Back inside of our AI agent, we'll be able to see all of the unique users within the managed users section, at which point we can decide how long they have access to the AI agent or delete their access completely. Hope you found this video helpful and we'll see you next time.